get on fair follow me will do can I cinematic mode this bad boy so what's your plan here well I figure before we do anything we need to make sure John's even still at this prison. And how do we do that? We need to get up high enough to get a proper look at the place. What? It's on an island, ain't it? Unless you're planning on learning how to fly. That's exactly what we're gonna do. I found us a hot air balloon. You ain't serious. Now, the pilot, or whatever you call him, he thinks we're just in it for a lesson. Bit of a tour. <laughs> He's quite the character. I think you'll like him. You know, I'm impressed. You really stepped things up, ain't you? Hey, we didn't know if you was even coming back. The whole thing hit folks real hard. Going through all these poses. You can see it. Heron's gone falling fully into the bottle. Strauss has a bag of nerve. Swanson, well, Swanson's actually gone and cleaned up his act. So, I guess it ain't all gone to shit. I'm just happy you boys were able to find us. Javier said he got the letter I left at the post office. That was a good idea. Until the Pinkerton showed up. Oh, by the way, I've been hunting O'Driscoll boys. Killed two of the sons of bitches at a campsite last week. What? Yeah, seems they've drifted down this way now. You're a busy woman, Sadie Adler. She a beauty, ain't she? From here on the ground, yes. Mr. Bullard? <laughs> Mr. Bullard? Ah, Mrs. Adler! It's good to see you. Good to see you. Ah, uh, This is my friend I told you about, Mr. Morgan. Ah, yes, Arturo Bullard. At your service, sir. At your service. Arthur Morgan. Well, it's a nice, fresh day for flying, sir. A day like today, and Icarus would have made it across the sea. <laughs> have you ever flown before, sir? No. Oh, it's quite a thing. Quite a thing. Now, put these on and hop in. Well, ain't she coming? Ah, well, women can't fly, sir. Are you insane? They can't. Oh, no, sir. It does terrible damage to them, to their vapors. I thought everyone knew about that. Why, a delicate flower like Mrs. Adler? <laughs> Heavens above or below. Ah. Where'd you find this guy? I told you two would get on. Uh, are you sure about this? Certain, <laughs> sir. Quite certain. Mrs., let us away. Wish us luck. I've only crashed twice. Now, uh, pull on that rope uh, and hope for the best. Ah. This man. You boys have fun. How did you get out of this? <laughs> up, up, and away. Right. Time to catch a few vapors of our own. It's a little overcast, but I'm expecting some good wind once we're high enough. <laughs> we should still have some decent views over the river. Now, one hates to be coarse, but on the subject of ablutions, liquids over the side, solids, do your utmost to levy the situation until we land. <laughs> okay, Mr. Bowen. I had a client once who fell foul to a rotten oyster on the ascent. A decidedly harrowing experience for all involved. <laughs> Keep going, sir. We need to get up above the clouds. This man. It really is stunning up there. You'll have seen nothing like it. The hot air. I had never been on one. I, I think I want to try it now. What could go wrong? Who is that? Oh, my God. Yes, heavenly indeed. Quite remarkable, isn't it? Feels like we have a nice westerly wind, so keep her around this height. This particular vessel is state of the art, sir. Imported from Europe. Won't find more than a couple of these on this side pond. So long as it works.
This is trippy. There's a line like right here. You sure you shouldn't be doing this? Oh, not at all. A child could operate this with a little supervision. <laughs> Besides, Mrs. Adler told me you were very keen to learn the ropes. We have plenty of those. She did, did she? I'm trying to keep it to like the top of my basket right there. But I think this cloud is about to go elsewhere. Oof, dropped down pretty low on that one. Author and Arturo. How perfect is this? My mother was a keen student of the Italian eight. My brother's called Baldassario, so you could say I got off lighting. Look, I I'm trying to concentrate here. <laughs> trying not to die. How can we see if Arthur, I mean not Arthur, Jack, is still here? We're gonna crash Did them. you breakfast in the city this morning, Mr. Morgan? Not exactly. Well, I have a boiled egg in my pocket here that you're very welcome to. I think I'm alright, thank you. Recalling the ablutions uh, discussion. Well, just say the word. So, if I may ask, what got you interested in the pursuit of aviation? I didn't, exactly. Mrs. Adler thought she'd surprise me. Oh, a very nice woman. And no shrinking violet. Definitely not. I prefer slightly more feminine attire on a lady, but variety is the very spice of life, as they say. <laughs> or is it, though? Did you know they locked up the man who wrote that in a mental asylum? I did not, Mr. Bullard. See that building up ahead on the island? That's the infamous Sisica Penitentiary. We shouldn't fly too near to it, though, sir. Sorry, we're going in for a closer look. What do you mean? Mr. Morgan, please, this is most irregular. Well, you want a happy customer, don't you? Look, this isn't funny, Al. What on earth are you doing? The guards are bound to spot us. Calm down. They won't care if we stay high enough. I'm just looking for a friend of mine. A friend? Poor bastard has a habit of being in the wrong place at the wrong time. I heard they got him working the fields in a chain gang. Dear God. I can't do it anymore now. Hmm. The wind. Well, this is most unusual. Relax, Mr. Bullard. Here, take over. And keep us well away. I'll do my best. This filly isn't the easiest to control, you know. Whoops. I can't believe we're doing this. Nope, not there. Please hurry. That's not him. Okay, he ain't by the barn. Hmm, that could be him. Yep, that's him. Ah, my God! What are you doing? They're shooting at us! I can see that. Ascent! Ascent! Oh, my Lord. Picking up. We should stay at this altitude. It's heading northwesterly, so that should take us back to land. Here, God, I'm shaking like a leaf. <laughs> All right, we're in the clear now, Mr. Bullard. Get up. Good Lord, my heart is pounding. <laughs> you almost made my vitamin water come out my nose. The specifics of this job were not described to me at all sufficiently. Well, it's done now. Ah. Uh. 
Man. <laughs> he almost did it. I like his character. There's Annisberg. Sure. Good lord. Is that is that Mrs. Adler? Where? Being chased. Yes. Try and get us near. Will there be more trouble, sir? I expect so. Oh crap. I'm starting to rather enjoy this. Missing all kind of shots. That sucks that that dude died.
doesn't make any sense. You ain't goddamn man. I killed better men than you. Take cover, Arthur. Can't stay out of trouble for one goddamn hour. You got that poor bastard killed for his troubles. I kind of liked him. They got Comb, the government. They got Comb O'Driscoll. They're gonna hang him in San Denis. Hang him? Okay. Mm -mm. He's already been tried twice for murder and found guilty. Sure, no doubt he'll escape again. No, he won't, because we're gonna make sure of it. I... We have our own problems with the law, in case you ain't noticed. Dutch will want to see him swing. Sure, Dutch. He wouldn't even help us with Marston. And our situation is really messed up right now. You know how things is. Bastard's gonna swing. I'm gonna make sure of it. Closely followed by Marston. You saw him? Yes, in the fields. Okay. Then we go rescue him. <coughs> From a state penitentiary? No. But from the fields? Yes. That we can manage. Well guarded. Guarded, sure, but not behind bars. No, it's not behind bars. So, that's how we'll do it. Bust him from his work detail. I guess. It's best just the two of us go. <coughs> the two of us is all there is, anyhow. Good, because two is all we'll need. I'll get us a boat, a little one, and we'll sneak in and get him out of there. Meet me at Copperhead Landed. Thank you, Arthur. She make it sound Whatever so simple. You say, boss. I heard that. Man, she is crazy. I'd like to thank you all for watching. Like, subscribe, comment. Tell your mom. Tell your dad because they're out there getting everyone. And remember, in the words of the great Lei Wu Long, you are not good enough. Catch you in the next episode. Look at Farrah. What a stud he is, what a stud.